Welcome back to another episode of Automotive Insight. Today we have the opportunity to go over the coating process. Um, we are working on a Volkswagen Golf and we are replacing the window motor. Uh, the motor has a computer attached to it and you have to code this depending on the function of the vehicles. Now recently we've done a, a quite a few reviews of a couple scan tools. So I'm going to I just sort of to help to complete those reviews, I am going to do those scan tools to do the coding process because it says they're capable of doing that. So let's get started. <laughs> so the first one we're going to do, we're going to use the, the King Bowling K7. We'll go ahead and get it connected to the vehicle. We'll go under System Selection. Passenger door electronics. Let's see what code module says. See, this gives you a list of the coding numbers that that options that can be available. I don't see our 1204, which is the original one that's in the vehicle. So in the code module, it gives you the ECU coding number, the 1204, triple zero twelve zero four. This is where you would enter that number in after installing the new module. So we're going to write that down, and then we're going to install the new module and see what this says. To give an example why we code, why the module needs coding anyway, if you look at the uh, the driver side mirror, it's got a turn indicator in it. I've got the new um, uh, window, window motor and door module in there. You can see that the mirror is not flashing. The window does work with just the new module installed, but, but the turn signal in the mirror isn't working. Okay, so we got our, going back into our door module, and we're going to go back to the same coding section. So the coding in this one is 8368. I can't see my numbers. 1204. 000-1204 was our original coding numbers. Code is successful. Okay. All right, modules coded. Now our turn signal in the mirror is working. So it was able to, pro to code the passenger door module with the King Bowling K7. So we got everything back together. Uh, just to finish it up, you know, you go through and check all your functions. The auto up and down works. Uh, the door locks do work. I'm not exactly sure if those go through the door module. I'm sure it does because everything else in here goes through that module. Um, the turn signal, uh, the turn signal on the mirror functions also. Yeah, you know, we just wanted to give some more information for what was available to us while we had this vehicle and doing this repair. But that's going to wrap up this video. I may not have all your answers. Hopefully I had some. That being said, we'll see you on the next one. All right, well that concludes uh so we was able to successfully so we was able to pro to code the passenger door module